Early this evening, rains and thunderstorms were reported over the provinces of Leyte and Cebu as Metro Manila, Central and Southern Luzon continue to experience cloudy skies with some rains today due to the enhanced southwest monsoon. Good evening. Here is our weather forecast for tomorrow, Thursday, September 26. As we can see from our satellite image, tropical located northeast outside the Philippine area of responsibility is the one responsible on enhancing the southwest monsoon these past few days. As it moves away heading north, weakening its effect over the southwest monsoon, another low pressure area was spotted over West Philippine Sea this morning. At 4 p.m. today, this low pressure area was now estimated at 240 kilometers west of Lubang Island. According to Pag-asa, it has the potential to become another typhoon. If this happens, it will be named Paulo, the 16th tropical disturbance this year and second for this month of September. The southwest monsoon continues to affect southern Luzon and uh, Visayas. Tomorrow, the provinces of Mindoro will experience cloudy skies with moderate to occasionally heavy rains and thunderstorms, which may trigger flash floods and landslides. While Metro Manila, Central Luzon, Calabarzon, Bicol Region, Palawan, Marinduque, Romblon, and the Visayas will have cloudy skies with light to moderate rain showers and thunderstorms. The rest of the country will be partly cloudy to cloudy with some isolated rain showers or thunderstorms. Moderate to strong winds blowing from the southwest to west will prevail over central and southern Luzon, and the coastal waters along these areas will be moderate to rough. As of this time, no gale warning was issued by Pagasa and three-day weather extended weather outlook. Over Metro Manila, cloudy with rain showers or thunderstorms are expected over the next three days with average temperatures of 24 to 30 degrees Celsius. As well as in Metro Cebu, with cloudy skies with rain showers or thunderstorms are expected tomorrow until Saturday with temperatures of 24 to 30 degrees Celsius. And for Metro Dabao, over the next three days, expect partly cloudy to cloudy skies with isolated rain showers or thunderstorms with temperatures of 25 to 33 degrees Celsius. Tomorrow, three days after the equinox, daytime is still four minutes longer than nighttime as sunrise tomorrow will, will be at 5.45 in the morning and sunset will be at 11 minutes before 6 in the evening. And for our astronomy photo of the day, NASA Curiosity rover has found yet more evidence of ancient Martian water. This time during a recent pit stop along the way towards a huge red planet mountain. The one-ton Curiosity rover paused to examine a few rocks late last week, making the first of five planned science stops en route to the 5.5-kilometer high Mount Sharp. The break was fruitful, returning further signs of long-ago liquid, researchers said. This image shows the view from the NASA's Mars rover Curiosity after it uses an autonomous proximity placement technique to place its tool-laden robotic arm on a rock science target called Darwin during the 399th Martian day or Sol of its mission. This image was released last September 23 by NASA, last September 23, 2013. And that is our weather forecast for tomorrow, Wednesday, September 26. For News Live, this is Edmond Rosales, giving you the latest weather update. Clear skies be with you always. <music>